I was going down to discuss a contract issue with the group, and as I'm coming into town, and I'm coming off the major interstate, and I'm coming to this little road into town, and the holiday displays, and I won't call it the holiday displays, the Christmas displays were up. This is in the municipality, and one of the things in, in, the, in the municipal display was keep Christ in Christmas. And this was not that long ago. This was not that long ago. Now, yeah, I would characterize that town as a blue-collar town, you know, that probably had a very, very, very strong Christian tradition. You know, but what about the newbie who comes into town and is offended by that? And we're going to get to all that in, in holiday displays, because there's one of the great lines in, 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 in constitutional law, uh, which I have to read right now just because it's, it's, in the, it's in the thing that I did on holiday displays, but it's one of the all-time great lines, which says, oh, I thought it was in here. It's in one of the things that I wrote, and it says something to the effect that with the coming of the holiday season, in addition to the reruns of It's a Wonderful Life and all the other good things, comes a plus. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. The Christmas season brings with it not only sidewalk Sanders, mercantile mania, and endless reruns of It's a Wonderful Life and Miracle on 34th Street, but a spate of constitutional litigation testing the limits to which governmental or public bodies may legally join in the festivities. One of the great lines from, from any justice in terms of, yeah, in this whole area, what we have with regard to uh, the holiday season. What we'll say right now, because those of you who are around long enough, always thought, going back to Thomas Jefferson, that there is a wall of separation between church and state. That goes back to Jefferson. Okay. When we start getting into the cases, it's great. There's no wall there anymore. There's a jagged line. And basically, it's going to come down to a case-by-case -case interpretation of some judge or justices who are going to decide. It. And now, it, is it going to be your school district, though? That's all it's going to be. Is it going to be your school district?